Alright, welcome back everybody. Some more Binding of Isaac, Wrath of the Lamb. And uh, I've been having some good fun with a lot of people, answering comments, and uh, TR4 and N3 has been playing some Isaac along with me on his own time. And I wanted to uh, not only give him a little shout out for the nice comments he's been leaving, but uh, we've been discussing how Judas is kind of a pain in the ass. So uh, let's see if I can... If I can change that a little bit. We will start out with just the one heart, which makes it a little difficult off the bat. But we start out with the Book of Belial, which for one room gives us massive damage. So, grab a little penny. Continue on, shoot the poop. Should be uh, something that's relatively uh, <laughs> normal for a Binding of Isaac game. Anywhere else, not so much. A bomb. We'll save that, just in case we find a tinted rock. Shoot the poop. Really, there's, there's no reason never to do this. Cause see, look, free penny. Now, nothing else, but a free penny is a free penny. Okay. Little bomb. Self-sacrifice room, or... There. You know what? Let's, uh... Check out the rest of what the floor has for us. Okay, another treasure. Very interesting uh, layout. Okay. It's a good thing we ended up saving the bombs because I will use one of the bombs here and we'll try and find the secret room and also acquire two other bombs. So Jack and my pot friends. That's the thing about Isaac. A lot of you can be really good at Isaac and it does make a difference, but there's a lot of luck involved too. What drops see nine pennies makes a big difference. Uh, the shop is now viable, whereas uh, three pennies, a slot machine, greed, something like that wouldn't have been nearly as useful. All right, the Yum Heart, I don't want anything to do with that. The Yum Heart, when you pick it up, uh, Magdalene starts with this, by the way, one of the characters you can unlock. You hit Spacebar, and it, it refills some health for you. And it refills up, I think, somewhat often, but with rolling with one Max Heart right now, <laughs> being able to refill half a damage is not a big deal. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. The chest. More health we can't use. We don't have a key yet either. But how about we see what we can get here since we have a couple bombs. Okay, paid for itself at least. I will want to pick up the other bomb or the other chest that's over in this left room to see if we can get a key to drop. If we get a key to drop, I'll visit the shop early. Oh, okay, lots of hearts. The troll engine and, and major effect today. Can't use a lot of hearts when I don't have any to refill. Yeah. All right. Okay. Wow. Famine right off the bat. A horseman on uh, the first floor. Not exactly hard, but and yeah, he does take out his own grandmother wise. So just keep working on him. Um, but I, I really don't want the item that he's gonna get. I'm not gonna be mad about it, but it's not. With Judas, I could really use the health, um, some type of offensive item. So if the enemies are dead, they can't damage me. Some you. We will get our cube of meat, which you can't reroll. So it does add a little defense for us. We did pick up the spirit heart, which is really good. But uh, yeah, you know it is what it is. Getting pooped on. Curse of darkness, so we're not gonna be able to see the mini map. Which is a real pain in the ass. Dodging, dodging, getting lucked. Alright, there's a key in there. I will want to grab that so we can go to our item room. Ah, uh, the Dead Sea Scrolls. These are not a big fan of them either, to be honest. Uh, they recharge, I think, probably often, I'm not sure. But you hit them and it gives you a random effect. The ne uh, Necronomicon right there would have blown up everything in the room. But next time I use it, who knows what it would have done. So we'll stick with the Book of Belial, which I forgot to use for our boss fight. And continue on. Nice easy room with some couple flies. A key, nice. A sacrifice room. The more you damage yourself, there's a possibility of an item spawning. Uh, we don't really have the ability to give up health right now. Whoa. 
We never did go back to the shop, did we? Silly me. Alright, so, now that we have a couple keys, we will go to the shop. Alright, I will pick up the compass. It's on half cell, that's why it's red with the steam cell. It won't help us so much this map because of the curse, but this will show us where all the really relevant um, uh, rooms are. Okay. Book of Belial right off the bat, and you can immediately see the damage we're doing compared. Oh, you're almost double. We do have two champion monsters. It'll be really easy to deal with. About four more shots, probably. There we go. All right, pentagram, awesome. Damage up. Uh, I don't want to make a deal with the devil just because I don't have the uh, hearts to do it, but I did want to come in here. There's a chance that Krampus can spawn in here, which is like the Fallen, but a little harder. And if you kill him, you get a damage up. Definitely item room right off the bat. Technology or technology two? Technology 2, a constant stream of lasers that also uh, penetrate enemies, but not uh, scenery. And we can still shoot tears. So it's actually a pretty cool pickup. First time I picked it up, but I did see it in a Let's Play with Northern Lion. So we'll see, we'll see how this works out. Shoot the red fire from afar, because they can't shoot you. Okay, there we go. Uh, not viable to go to the shop quite yet because we don't have the money for it. Ouch. Man, my frames have been dying out a little bit with the uh, Wrath of the Lamb, and I think it's probably from running dual monitors. And I'm always rendering something too. So if it, if it starts to show up in the videos and it gets annoying, please let me know. It's not, it's not worth inconveniencing you guys. Okay, we will have a sub-boss. Wow, super lust. She leaves a creep. Ouch. Okay, uh, Book of Allow. Wow, this is, I've never seen super lust. So here's, here's like I was talking about in one of the other videos. They do have super versions of the Deadly Sins. Pick up one of the pills. Come on, baby. Telepills. Okay, to the... Okay. Who the hell am I? So that's just like a random, it's not even a place on the map, I guess. It's just a random secret room? Or no? Yeah, okay, it was a secret room. So that's cool. Saved as a bomb. We did pick up a, uh, a fate heart. I, I still don't know what they're called. And uh, if we're able to get through the level with this, uh, it'll become one red heart, which is super lucky. We have little mini greed heads. Pain in the ass. Kind of hoping the laser two did a little more damage than this. It's nice to have constant damage, but I don't even—I don't know if it scales on damage either. Like getting damage ups, I don't know if that's gonna make it stronger. So we do have the pentagram and the starting base damage of Judas. Oh fuck! Should not have gotten hit by that. I almost kind of—I think I prefer not having technology too. I like hitting. You know, really solidly. Not look, look how much damage that's taken. Huh. Really want that, so we will use a bomb to go over there. Ah, uh, I should have used it on the tinted rock over there. I didn't notice that it was tinted. Um, that would have allowed me to possibly get a spirit heart there or a bomb, and then get that three cents. So that's a fail on my part. We are rocking technically four hearts right now, which is good. Go fight the boss. Okay, so the Fallen, not a bad uh, not a bad boss to run into. There's a possibility we will get, um, hopefully, a good item. Okay, now he's in his second form. Nice thing about technology, too, is it's going to shoot right through him and hit both. Wish they're not lined up anymore. Ooh, we need to be faster. Okay, one down. Oh wow, I really thought I was gonna dodge that. I'd stop looking at my character because I thought I'd have that. All right. Ooh, wow, really? Guppy's paw. You know what? Let's let's go. No, I can't do it. 
I can't bring myself to do it. It'll give up one of my red container hearts for three spirit hearts. I can't give up Book of Belial. I don't feel like it's scaling though. Okay, so now we have our white container heart went to a red. I don't know if Tech 2 is scaling though. To be honest, it just it really feels like I should be doing more damage for the character and the items I've picked up. Yeah. Oh well. It is nice to be able to shoot people from far away. Um, that room that was above me that looks like two books is literally two book items that you can go in there and grab. Book of Belial being one of the better ones. Book of Revelations, I would say, maybe a little better. Um, but I, I don't have the key to waste on it, even if I did want to. Now, Ouija board would have been nice, actually, now that I think about it, to shoot through stuff. Since he was a blue Larry Jr., he did drop his spirit heart. It's a really high chance of doing that. Okay, we should be able to shoot through the zombies, because the penetrating shots had hit him, which is... Makes this alone worth it. Head down here, hopefully grab a key to go to the item room. Floaty nub. Not in the position I wanted to be in. Oh my goodness. Really? Really, game? Fuck you! Oh, there goes all my spirit hearts. Jeez, that could've, that could've gone worse, but that could've gone a lot better. Of beats. God, the, my my base speed right now is so awful. Come on, keep bombs. Eh, just in case. Yeah, I'm not I'm not digging technology too really a whole lot right now. It'll come in handy in a couple fights. It really will. But I think I kind of would have preferred just having the regular tiers. I don't feel like I'm doing enough damage with it. Give me key, give me key. Uh, terrible. Judgment, okay. Uh, yeah, sure, why not? Spawns our little beggar buddy. See if we can get something good out of him. Okay. Kind of gambling on you instead of going to the shop. Wow, oh, Kamikaze. Kamikaze's terrible. I won't even show you what it does because it'll damage me, but it'll explode dealing damage to people around him. So, Judgment kind of screwed us right there. Oh, well. Okay, same room again. Luckily, they opened up a room for me, which will allow me to kill them easier. Come on. No keys. Man, come on, guys. Give me some keys. Give it centipede. It should be pretty easy with tech. Okay. More bombs. Troll engine go. Um, yeah, well, we can. Oh, God. Bad situation. Okay, there we go. There we go. I do have more than enough bombs, so let's see if we can. If I see, by hitting the rock on this side, it kicked it this way and filled in the hole. That's what I'm doing. A key. Perfect. We'll go we'll backtrack all the way back, go to the item room, and hopefully get something good out of an item room. <laughs> we're, we're getting a lot of things that I, I just. That's the thing about Book of Belial and even Isaac uh, with his D6. You start out with really good items that you don't necessarily want to give up or shouldn't give up. Uh, chemical pill. Okay, chemical pill. Uh, every other shot is going to do massive damage. I don't know how that works with technology too. Um, but I think at least the tears will do some good uh, damage every other time it shoots. So, eh, I think I'd rather have had maybe some health up or something like that. Okay, we are coming up to our boss room. This will probably be some type of horseman, to be honest, which will give us a second meat upgrade. No, the hollow. Immediately. Okay, so a, a diagonal Larry Jr. Wow. Uh, this is even easier than Larry Jr. It's like Skolex. Ah, oh, damn it. Really? Range and tears up. Don't need any of that because I have technology. <laughs> I'm getting trolled hard. That's good. Uh, I can show you 
hopefully how to overcome that. I uh, homing troll bomb. Don't know if I'm going to be needing to go this way. No, I probably won't. It's not even worth going that way because it looks like the boss is to the left along with the oh. Okay. Uh, a coin appeared over here. Cool. <laughs> Maybe because the bomb was there. I don't know. Probably just glitch. Okay, keep working our way down. That went really well. Once again, technology actually doing something good. It'll work well on these guys too, technically. If I can get to them. God, it just, it just doesn't do much damage. Troll bomb, non-homing, thankfully. Don't have enough money for the item or the uh, shop. I will do this. Put a bomb there. Watch the bombs. Pew. Now attainable. Spend a bomb to get a bomb. Got a key. Check the item room. Ouch. Tarot card box. Not very good either. But I will pick it up. Use it once. The emperor. That'll get us right to the boss, which... Eh, <laughs> might be useful in the womb later. Okay, same thing again. Grab another key. Just your luds. Was able to get him to shoot the rock out of the way, which is nice. Getting a little harrowing. Ow. <laughs> Alright, you know what? Let's let's jump in the item room. Um and see if we can get something that's gonna make this a little easier. Hopefully we get a steam cell. Or I was hoping a spirit heart for five, but no luck. Could get the tarot card, maybe it'd give us a hero font, balls of steel kind of effect, which is two spirit hearts. But I think I'll save on to it. Ooh, not a good room. <laughs> Okay, you know what? Technology, you suck. I don't like you anymore. We're going to do this again. All right, here we go, everybody. Starting redoing Judas. I've noticed with the, the Wrath of the Lamb expansion, it actually makes it a lot harder in the fact that you don't get the um, health upgrades you used to. Like, you used to every room, you could get a really good chance that a boss would drop a health upgrade. And you could then really start snowballing uh, pretty well. But I haven't been noticing uh, many health upgrades. Now that might just be a, a thing he's changed in the game though, in general. I don't think so though. Okay. Working on these guys. We do have a champion which will be nice. As long as we don't get hit by him, we'll get a penny. Eh, kinda expected that, but still better than nothing. We're up to four cents. Shoot some poop, take a drink. All right, a bomb and a key, really good. I'll take that as well. <sighs> okay, item room. All right, uh, yeah, the rosary, nice. Uh, it's gonna give us a lot of spirit hearts to start and it'll increase the chance of a Bible dropping in the shop and uh, in a couple of other places. And I'll show you what the Bible does. I'll actually probably even pick up, uh, I might pick up the Bible. Kind of interesting to see what what would happen if you used the Bible against the final boss in uh, the expansion. Another oh, spirit heart, nice. Okay, so pretty much what the Bible does is when you fight It Lives and Mom's Foot, you click Bible and it instantly kills her. Instantly. If you use it on Satan, you'll instantly die, so don't do that. But um, I would have to give up the Book of Belial, and not that I feel that that's cheap. I uh, We were talking about how Judas is can be difficult to beat it on, and if I use something like the Bible, I think that's kind of defeating the purpose of showing a Judas run. So I want to show you that, kind of how to play Judas, or you know, that it is possible, it's just a little difficult. Alright, perfect. We did get another max heart, and we do have four spirit hearts. So once again, see, uh, I'm lucking out this time, and I'll be able to have the health to hopefully pull me through the rest of the game now. But we will see. Okay. Popcorns. Oh, wow. 
That was slow. I just watched that in slow motion come at my, come at me, bro. And he did. And it was not appropriate. I'd love to go down here and get one of the free chests, but I don't want to waste spirit hearts for it. Because I can refill a red heart and I'd go down there, but no, I'm not using a blue heart. I can't refill. Okay, we have the boss right off the bat. Oh, also, from what I'm being told now, now we can't go into the boss duel room, unfortunately, because I got hit. From what I'm telling about uh, basements, necropolis, cellars, all that's caves, it's random, I'm being told now. It's not whether you do well or do poorly. So, overall, I have no idea what it what affects it. So, <laughs> definitely check the, the Isaac Wikipedia. It has all this information, what every item does, what every trinket does. So... Yeah, we'll pop in here real quick. Explode you. Paid for itself. I'll play this a couple times. Nothing else. Get some money out of it. Nice, a blood bag. Oop, max health up one. And in victory, I'm going to blow up a slot machine. Vandalism! Heroic vandalism! If you watch Dungeon of the Dreadmore. Shop. Uh, I'm not going to risk it. Okay. My computer, it's just Binding of Isaac. Oh, it's um, probably because I'm recording it with uh, an Arrow desktop, which is the only way I can with wraps. And so it's recording my desktop as well. But it really, really makes it a lot harder on the darn uh, computer. Sorry, computer. Oh, homie troll bomb. Another spirit heart. Pills. Running. <laughs> Gonna have to go through that again in a little bit. That'll be fun. Uh, so I'm really lucking out here, which is kind of unfortunate in the fact that most most of you are not gonna get this many spirit hearts and items like quite like this in a run. It's just, it doesn't happen very often. And I want to kind of show a harrowing run, even though last time I did and I got ooh, got my butt kicked last uh, the first time on this video. <laughs> so we got a big shiny eye. Okay. Awesome. I'm a Cyclops. Awesome reference to mythology, by the way. Oh, God, bombs. Should he try to use those to find a secret room, but... So, it looks almost like chocolate milk, and the fact that you can charge up, it probably does a lot of damage. But I'm firing a little slower. Which is okay. Okay, so we have Gemini. We will bust out our Book of Belial. Holy mother. Doing lots of damage. Do some shots. Do some dodges. Ooh. You first, I guess. Where did I? Boom! Nice. Perfect. Range of Tears Up will work really well, actually, with this upgrade. It doesn't look like it affected it too much on the Tears Up, but the range will be useful. All right. We'll continue along. Dude, our character looks awesome. Oh, look. Oh, so much damage. I love it. New favorite item. So, hammer away at the spiders before they can get to us. Whoa. When it hit the spider, the, the tear got smaller but kept going. Interesting. Sure, let's do this. We'll use our Book of Belial too, because we'll have it recharged by the time uh, by the time we get to the boss. Yeah, so it it can go through people even. This is a great upgrade. It gets a little smaller and probably does a little less damage, but it's still there's a chance of some type of uh, penetration at least. Giggity. Oh yeah, this. This, this, I'm saying 100% chance of winning this run. This is... I'm outfitted. Now let's just make sure I don't do something so ridiculously stupid like I usually do to lose. I'm pointing to the outfield with the bat. I'm going to call the Babe Ruth right here. Okay, so here we go. Going to keep crawling through the catacombs. So yeah, it looks like if, if the enemies 
some spirit heart. If the enemy's kind of weak, um, some of the damage will continue along. Uh, cancer. What did cancer do? I think tears up. Drink it. Can't believe I dodged all that. That was, that was lucky. <laughs> the testicle flies shall die. We'll go look for the item room real quick. Moving along pretty quickly too. I wonder if I got a speed up. Son of a bitch! Okay, the perception on that stuff's kind of difficult sometimes. For me, at least. Aw, oh, you fucking fly. I should I, I knew I should have uh, killed the boss first. Uh, my chances with the deal with the devil are slim now because I've been getting damaged. That's okay, though. Don't necessarily want to make a deal with him just because I do have plenty of health and I'd like to keep it that way. Yes, just so much more damage. I do have to get a little more up close and personal with some of the fast guys, so I guarantee can hit them, uh, unlike uh, technology, but I can actually kill these guys before they get to me. Okay, almost viable for the shop. Uh, a little plunger, a little dynamite plunger, huh? Hmm, not sure what that does. Maybe explodes, like drop a bomb and then they won't explode. Let's see. Huh, can't tell. I'm not giving a book of allow for that though. Maybe it explodes, maybe all the, the bombs in the room or something like that. Like for the homing bombs, you could explode them immediately. I don't know if that's what it does, but possible. We do have a few extra bombs, so let's check for the secret room right here. Yeah, buddy. Perfect. Exactly what I was hoping for. We're definitely lucking out this run. So now the shop is viable. We'll pop back to the shop. See if we can buy anything game breaking. Although we'll probably fight. Probably fight greed. Nope. Oh, and there's the Bible. I do not want to buy that. Picking up the rosary is going to make the Bible appear, if not in every shop, pretty often. So that's one less slot you're going to have for something else. Which kind of sucks, but. You know, if. if if you do feel like one-shotting mom and it lives, the Bible's amazing. But uh, we'll have to fight enemies after that, and uh, so this is more of a gosh, this is more of a, a classic Larry Jr. room, even though we're fighting the Hollow again. Right in the face! Right in the face! What a maroon! Oh, I thought I could sneak one in there. Boom. Okay, uh, stem cells are thing. More health up. <laughs> we have plenty of damage. We got plenty of health. That's good times. Maybe some tears up would be nice. Or, uh, what else, what else can we use? More health. <laughs> More damage. Very, very transparent person. I, I, I like damage. I like health. I like shooting things in the face. Or testicles as this thing is. I will use a bomb to get over here. Perfect. 11 more cents. Now we're almost viable for a couple shops. And or a judgment as well. What do we got here? Tears up. Perfect. Definitely getting a little bit faster. Oh yeah, two shots to take these guys out. I'm doing good damage. Plus the fact that they penetrate just a little bit is uh, very useful. Okay. Big thing too, uh, I always recommend when you first get in the room, immediately take uh, inventory of what's going on. Assess the situation and react properly. And we go diagonal through that to get that. Um, because sometimes they'll just throw a bunch of stuff at you and if you take a second to kind of figure out what's going on before everything loads, um, you'll have time to react. If you don't take too long, a lot of times you can get yourself stuck in a shift situation. Like see, immediately running there helps me out. 
Now, once again, this is Isaac. There is a big luck factor involved. More bombs. We're doing really, really well with a lot of stuff. Keeping calm, too. That's a big thing. <laughs> okay. Uh, we we got to be fighting greed in here. No. Okay. Book of Revelations. At half price. Uh, sure. Let's switch that out. Because I do feel like I'm doing good damage right now. Always use a little bit more survivability with some of the. Uh, depending on who I go to fight for the end boss, I'm probably going to get damaged. Okay, you know what? Let's fight the boss right off the bat. Not oh, great. Uh, Meat Boy upgrade will be getting. What I could have done actually, if I was really trying to play hardcore, <laughs> is actually use the Book of Balal on the boss and then switch it back out. Okay, our cube of meat upgrade again. So now we have another guy. Sh oh, no, this is our first cube. The last time we had cube meat. All right. Ouija board so I can shoot through stuff. Or s money is power. I've never shown money is power, so let's do that. So every 10 coins or 10 pennies we have after this, it doesn't count beforehand, uh, we'll get a little damage upgrade. So it's... We'll have to see if we find money. Trying to just like, since these are my first few episodes actually on YouTube, I do have some on own that I played a long time ago. I want to show some of the different items and, and show how they affect. Now, if I was really trying to seriously beat this, uh, I probably would take money's power, even though we do have a good build. Just because, I don't know, there, it's just there's too many chances that you're not going to find what you need to make it useful lovers that'll give us two um, two red hearts if we need it you got to pick them up they're, they're not uh, heart containers unfortunately that would be amazing Ooh, I think uh, I think my cube of meat saved me there from that hit okay. not gonna go for that oh wow I'm surprised that that didn't uh, explode the TNT with a direct hit Okay, here's our item room. Ch toothpicks, right? Tears up, yeah. Uh, I don't know if it's getting faster anymore, to be honest. It, it the um, Cyclops pickup might be hindering that. Try for a secret room. We got extra bombs. Not surprising. We've been getting too lucky with it, all the other ones. So let's try again. I'd be somewhat suspect if I got that, that first one, a secret room. <laughs> okay, let's try again. Really? Last one. <laughs> now we now I feel like I have to. Okay. Come on, secret room. There we are. Nine more pennies. Nice. So, our money is power might start actually working for us pretty soon. And one more penny, we should be able to get a damage upgrade. Did we want... No, we don't want the reaching board. Okay, the depths part one. Let's see if we can get one. Come here, buddy. Whee! Nice. Able to take these guys out in one shot makes these guys a lot less difficult. They're a pain in the butt, otherwise. There we go. A couple good side shots. Book of Revs up again. We will use that for another heart. Oops. Landed right on top of me. Oh, champion, no. Go away. Damn it. That was bad. Keep a meat save me there, I think. Because I was lamenting my luck with the leaper and almost got hit by him again. Alright, dude. Piss me off. 
Ah, uh, boom! Thank you very much. Okay, our health isn't looking as good anymore, which is a good thing that we ended up going with the Book of Revelations. Luck down. Okay. Uh, I'm not really sure what to think about that. Greed! Nice! This is actually the perfect uh, thing. Not only is it an easy kill, but we're going to get our damage up with our money as power now. Uh, the tower card. <sighs> it's a piece of shit, but let's do this. And see if we can find the secret room. Nope! If we can get those near like the top middle, maybe it could have uncovered a secret room if it was there. Eh, you know what, we got extra bombs, let's check anyway. Oh. Yeah, it's, it's actually, if, if I had a different build, I probably wouldn't be wasting bombs quite as much. Uh, the zombies can be very useful. Uh, some of the uh, boss fights, like it lives, can be really useful to have a uh, bomb to use in combat. But we're doing pretty good overall, so not too worried about it. And sure. Okay. I'm hoping for a key, so at least we can get in the item room later, but... I like to play a little recklessly when I play this game, it's fun. It feels really good when it pays off. Oh! Oh! Boom. Three spirit heart, book of revelations up, so two spirit hearts from that room. I will take it, sir. Oh man. The range, my range is good. There's our key. Perfect. This run is coming together very nicely. Uh, check in a sec. Nice. Yeah, definitely don't need uh, the Ouija board with this. Check for a secret room again. Nope. But we will grab our key out of that though. So now we should have enough keys to deal with the rest of this game. Nice. Spirit heart and more damage. <laughs> Might as well go through here and check this. What do we got here? Speed up. Okay. Cool. One more bomb. Woo. Keep working on that money is power. Okay, full bomb will be able to get us free bombs. And now that we're as fast as we are, we should be pretty good as long as I don't start running into things to be able to at least outrun things such as the Isaac zombies. Oops. Oops. Playing a little playing a little tag right here. I'm not doing so well. There we go. Another bomb, chest, key. Yeah, th this is this is one of my luckier runs. This is amazing some of the I mean like you could have a better uh, run when it comes to like uh, like mom's knife, a brimstone, flying, you know, stuff like that would really put this over the edge. But I gotta admit, um, we're playing Judas. We're rocking a lot of health. We've got a book of revelation, a lot of damage, good speed. Not wanting too much. No, technology too. You can shove it up your ass. Uh, I love this game. It would, of course, spawn that for me, saying, "Hey, you sure you don't want this again?" And I'm sure. Book of Revelations up for boss. Get another spirit heart. We're gonna fight war. Once again, not gonna be terribly thrilled at the item we're gonna get from him, but it's okay. Whew, didn't even get to do his bombs. So yeah, he's done. Pick up our second cube of meat again for the second time in this video. Go down to the depths, part two. Some brains. I'm surprised I didn't get hit right there. Might have been the meat boy. Oops. Really surprised I did get hit there. <laughs> Not paying attention. We'll continue up because I don't know where the hell I'm going. And up seems as good as any. Don't need that. We got <laughs> epic cag. Fuck you, game. 
<laughs> if you've seen my other videos, it's pretty much... They're just taunting me now. <laughs> Let's go right. Oh, uh, a chub. We will be able to take him out easily enough as he blows himself up. No items drop besides the key. That's okay. More guts. Easily killable. In a layout like this, there's some of the easiest enemies to go. Another chest with hearts we don't need. Check out the arcade. I don't want to spend the money. But I will... Cancer. Oh, when I get hit, I spawn a, a buddy. Nah. I'll take the cancer to keep my fire rate up. Okay, get some more money out of this. Blow it up. Nice. Okay. Shoot, forgot that I had hearts out here. Could have played it a few more times. Oh well. It's okay. So our money is power might have queued even twice now. Book of Revelations up again. Another bomb and key. Check out this. Uh, I think that's a trinket purse that allows you to do, do another... Hold another trinket. Don't want that. I don't know if that's what that is, but I think that might be it. Uh, fetuses. Back to full health. So definitely could have got more use out of that blood bank, if not even probably uh, another heart container if I kept playing it. Oh well, we'll probably get a penny out of you, my champion friend. If I can kill you. Nope, key. Uh, let's check for secret runes. I have plenty of bombs to do such. Try you. <laughs> right off the bat. Wow. 11 more cents. <laughs> Another money is power upgrade. Uh, let's check out a couple more rooms. We'll get our Book of Revelations filled up faster that way. And then also, um, maybe we can find something cool. More money, items. Okay, so a bomb and a key for our key and two pennies. Not the best trade, but could have gone a lot worse. I can use the pennies. Meat man saving me there. Thank you, sir. Oh, God. Ah! <laughs> Brain farted at the beginning of that stage. Okay. Two of clubs. No idea what that does. Maybe damage for a room. No. Yeah, then see the... The ones that are bleeding from their ass, too, shoot from their ass as well. So, I can't put that any nicer than that. <laughs> so, those guys could definitely become problematic if you're not paying attention. Okay, can't go to the boss duel room because we've taken damage. Yeah, shit. Might as well, let's, let's finish this uh, floor. Diagonal shots, no. Uh, luck down. Let's uh, not take that. <laughs> Still don't know what the luck... Oh, God, I thought I'd be able to kill it. Don't know what the luck skill does necessarily other than maybe like um, playing some of the games in the arcade. Okay, we'll continue along. Fight the boss, finally. Good damage on it, considering. Hit myself in there. Okay. Yeah, supposedly someone said uh, her hitbox is um, incorrect. Oh, we unlocked Samson. Oh, yeah, because we did pass on a couple of those crap, um, those crap treasure rooms. Cool game. Oh, God, run. 
Uh, the tick, I think that'll give us some um, more luck down. I think that'll give us some. I don't know what it does. The world, I will take that instead. Yeah. So it doesn't seem like the cancer is giving me a lot of fire right here. Alright, the womb. So I don't want to. You know what? Let's go in here. What is this? Telepathy for dummies. I think that just gives you, like. Wait. Why? What is. What am I wearing? Am I wearing, like, a present, a box, or a book, or. What is going on? Oh, telepathy for dummies, maybe you did it. Man, I can't believe I keep missing him. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Uh, I'm going to use this, and we're going to see the world card will now show us where we need to go. Diagonal walk in. First tears up. Perfect. Since, especially since we got rid of the cancer uh, trinket. Oh, judgment. What's up, buddy? Uh, sure, we can give you some money. Right off the bat. Okay, we get chemical pill again. This is going to be really useful. Every other attack is going to do massive damage. Uh, sure. I don't think this guy will give us quite as lucky as the other one, but we can give him a little bit of money. Bomb. Assuring his own destruction. A key. Oh, yeah. See, I knew I should have blown this up. Oh, what? Health up. All right, that was worth it, I guess. The game is pitying me for not uh, completing up. Uh, fortune telling thing, I don't know what that does. I think it, maybe it affects luck or something, but I don't like it. It scares me. Friends till the end. Okay, I think this just spawns some flies that can attack until they're dead. <laughs> Three more pennies, get back a little bit of what we gave judgment. Leave our forever alone buddy in there. Sorry, guy. Okay, so we lost one of our flies already. They do suicide onto people, unfortunately. Continue along. I made short work of that one. It's getting hit. Uh, child's heart. Another trinket. I'm not sure what that does. It might attract things like the magnet. Oops, you could react best on that. I'm not sure though. Either way, I don't want that. And I don't know what Tick does, actually. I thought it was... It, it's not a life leash, because I think that's Isaac's fork. Okay. We are dead. We'll get another upgrade to our good friend that I don't really want. The only, the only thing that's hard about this one is just keep an eye on where the horse is. It'll go top, medium, then bottom. Uh, the fact that the zombies are here, though, is annoying. The horse will kill the zombies, though, if he runs into them like that. There we go. Keep a meat. So now we have a, a little meat boy. But uh, there's a good chance he's going to start kicking bombs into me and making my life hell. So we'll see how that works out. Kill the guts first. The brain guts. Bye, bye, bye. Oh, wow. I didn't know the spikes didn't kill him. Go up. Oh god. The anal bleeding uh, gluttonies. Go meat man, go! Sure. Okay, bunch of bombs for a key. Okay. I have a feeling that we're going the right way. <laughs> the meat man threw off his uh, positioning. Get our book of revelations back in. Oh, got him. oh, got him. Okay, so that's a, a new colored a reskin bomb fly that just has one of the white um, invulnerable flies around it. Fun. Secret room. 99 bombs. Sure, why not? Yeah, 
Yeah, this is this is a good run. Okay, two regular lusts should go down pretty quick. We do have plenty of speed to stay ahead of them and damage. There we go. Got an explosive diarrhea pill, which I don't really need. Yeah. Most likely would take damage in there. Okay, meat boy. Go to work, buddy. Go to work. Oh, that would've gone. Blue pill. Uh, I think we've been long this before. Friends till the end. Okay, that'll work. Yeah, I don't want explosive diarrhea. I'll accidentally hit that or something. I have 99 uh, bombs now. Don't need it. Oof. Just ran right into that. Okay, went the wrong way. Stupid eye lasers. Luckily, we're fast, I say as I get hit. <laughs> Book a rev, get, a be get back that heart we lost. Alright. So now that we've pretty much seen everything to see in uh, the womb part two, uh, also known as the utero at the moment, let's let's go to the boss. How about? Uh, lock down, yeah. No thanks. Back up. You know what? Actually, it might not be a bad idea to go into the arcade. Come on. Meat man's just gonna eat you if you stay there. Good job, meat man. Go into the arcade. Kill the fly. Don't want to waste my money on that. I will take that. I will do this a few times. This does take full hearts now in the womb. Play you a few times, how about? See if we can get some health back. If not, we do have some waiting outside. A couple more times. We'll blow him up and use that. I don't want fly love really, so I don't care. <laughs> okay. Oh wow, he got me. You son of a gun. Yeah, make it do it. Just let me boy eat him. Okay, unlimited uh, keys for this. It lives. So many bombs, let's use them. Already down to about half health. Which is fantastic. Dropping some grenades and bombs and all that stuff. Boom! Robo baby! Nice. Okay. Uh, last time we tried to go through hell and fail miserably. So, let's do it again. Probably fail miserably. I, I, this one's hard. I, I think heaven's easier. Okay. Tinted rock. Gave us nothing useful. Lots of money, though. It's a plus. And... I'm not pushing my luck. <laughs> okay, the fallen. We'll be fighting him later. Meat boy will do a little damage on him. Not a whole lot though. If we can get him upgraded again, um, which is pretty much I think impossible now, um, he'd be doing a lot more damage, but that's okay. Okay, health we don't need. There's always I'd rather not need it than have it. Go left. Okay, another easy room. We're getting lucky with these rooms so far. Can't say that. Damn it. Can't usually say that with uh, Shul. Oof. <laughs> Good job, Meat Man. Good catch. Oh, another box inside. More money. Awesome. Awesome. 
Okay, that's... Not sure what to expect out of that, but that's more or less what I was expecting. Oh god. So much whiff! Ah, that was a bad room. Losing hearts and hemorrhaging them. Bust out our fly buddies. The odds aren't looking as good as they were a little earlier. <laughs> Ouch, especially if I just run into stuff. Okay, it's a combination of enemies I've never seen in a room before. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna go back and grab this heart real quick. I don't think this is the way to go. Fortunately, I, I'm not. I'm not finding the best. Oh. Okay, I was kind of hoping that wouldn't hit me. Ouch! Stop that. Okay. Yeah. I need to find a better recording on this because I uh, the slowdown is rough. I'm not used to it. 50% off sale is completely useless at this point. <laughs> oh god, Meat Boy, dude, seriously, you just tried to kill me. Right. You kill him. Asshole. Let's go back and grab the heart because I'm playing terribly right now. Okay, that'll help quite a bit, actually. Two of spades. No idea what this does. The Joker. Uh, what I have a feeling this is probably going to bite me in the ass. Alright, well, here we go. Drop a bomb. God damn it! Meat Man! You're killing me, bro! Okay, so the Joker took me to a deal with the devil, which is impossible on the deal with the devil room. I don't want those because I don't have the health. Okay, I, I guess I'll take that as a sign as explore a couple more rooms. Uh, random as hell. Oh, son of a... Meat man, I blame you. Go, go, eat him, eat his face. Oh, this is not looking good. Let's see what the chest has. Hopefully, something useful. Uh, what? The? Tammy's head. Oh yeah. So it just every room it it'll revive and it just shoots a bunch of stuff everywhere. Uh, not something that's gonna really help me at the moment. I'm gonna want to try and get the book of Revelation filled up now since I'm just wandering around. It is not looking good anymore. Low key. Yeah, the, the, the frame issues are, are screwing me up quite a bit, actually. Because they'll, uh, they'll be there one second, and then the next second, uh, it's a couple frames forward. And I'm not accounting properly for that. But it's not the reason I'm losing. I'm playing poorly because I'm playing poorly, so don't, don't get me wrong. <laughs> Um, oh, dude, me boy, I fucking hate you so much, man. <laughs> Seriously, I, I, it's really starting to become one of my more hated items. I'd rather just play without him than, you know, or not get an. Sometimes I, I might just stop picking him up. <laughs> there we go. Come on, something useful. Yep, I knew it. I knew it, you bastard. Give me, give me a shit ton of money. Ouch. Wasn't worth the heart. Kind of was. All right, everyone. I could take two hits on the final boss, and I am screwed after that. So let's see how this works. Really, I'm not trying to pull these down to the wire on purpose. I'd love to be able to be that good uh, and not be transparent, but... Okay, you know, whatever. Okay, we'll go this way. And just screw me up. One form down. 
Oh, God. I thought my character was faster. Okay, just strafe around him. Make sure he's shooting his little bullets first so he doesn't do that accidentally on you. Okay, final form. Just keep moving. You gotta watch out for the bomb fly that I couldn't see because of him. Oh, that was such an easy win too. <sighs> okay, next time I'm I'm gonna play serious and I'm gonna beat it because now that's I'm one in one in three now I think or one in four. That's not good. But thank you everyone for watching. I hope you had fun. I hope it was interesting. Uh, hopefully you fast forwarded through some of that so you didn't waste too much of your time. But uh, thanks for watching. And this is H.J. Tenchi saying have a good day.